So for this video, I'll have a little video of me actually playing in the corner. I don't actually have any fancy setup, so you guys could get a good over top video. But I was in a car accident about 10 years ago and injured my spine in the C5 to C7 area. It left me paralyzed from about the chest down. Sadly, this also included my fingers. So gaming was a bit of a rough spot for me. Over time, I've learned to compensate and play as optimally as I can. I still have some things that I can't really do well or just outright can't do, but I'll always give it a shot before I decide that. For example, the bow guns and bows are a little rough for me, having to hold aim, actually do the aiming, and firing all simultaneously. I can use a snapshot approach, but it's not nearly as optimal as I would like to play. Things like hitting the note I want when it comes to Y plus B or simply B notes is a little rough too. You'll see through the gameplay I move my hand over so my thumb sits across the Y and B button. When I press the button, I'm not actually moving my thumb. I'm just moving my entire hand down enough that my thumb presses the button down, which sometimes leads to me pressing B when I want to press Y plus B or vice versa. I actually have my trigger and bumper buttons switched so things are a little easier to reach. Tapping the bumper buttons with the inside of my hands is a lot easier than pushing in the triggers. I know people have mentioned before my use of the focus camera and unfortunately that's just something I have to use to play a little more optimally and have one less thing to control at a time. I also wanted to point out I'm using the pretty universal Master's Touch set with the Brute Tigrix chest and Garuga legs. Crit Eye, Crit Boost, and weakness exploit maxed with attack boost at level four for that 5% affinity. But I'll just leave you guys with the gameplay since it gives a better idea of just describing it. You can actually get a visual of how my fingers have locked into place over time. And just wait for the ending because it could have went horribly wrong, but turned out ending on a pretty good note. No pun intended. Like I said, this isn't a pity party, so don't feel bad for me. I'm doing just fine. But thank you guys as always for the support, have a good night, and happy hunting.